I think also, you know, we hear a lot from our community that when, by the time that people get involved, it's almost too late to have a, a really meaningful impact. You know, certain things have already been decided and the, the, the things that they're asked about are only, you know, not necessarily always, but sometimes they can feel a little bit tokenistic and um, it just feels like there's not much wiggle room and things have already been kind of set and they're just there to say like, yes, this is a good idea, like go ahead. <laughs> um, whereas I think with co-production, you know, the idea, well, we see one of the key differences is people being involved kind of from the very start and then all the way through a project rather than just at one stage the kind of research cycle. Um, and I, I just think that, yeah, that just opens it up to being, um, making sure that projects are really relevant to people for the things that matter to people kind of right from the start and not having that situation where people get involved and think I'm just here to kind of tell the researcher that what they're doing is great or um, mm. just validate existing ideas. It's actually that kind of generation of new ideas that, that could come about from co-production, I think. Mm. 